All right, good afternoon, everyone. I'm doing this review on the Zero Foxtrot brand shirts. I got a couple of new shirts, and I figured I'd do an unrevealing of one of them. There's a new one, Bloodlust. It's opening it up. Let's see firsthand what they look like and what they send you. I'm not paid by them. I'm not sponsored by them. I'm just wanting other people to see the shirts that they offer you. All right, so bag's empty now. So they send you usually a little card with some, uh, you know, some history of a veteran. So Robert B. Net. And then, of course, then they send you usually a little sticker. I usually throw those on my Yeti. Um, and then there's another little card right here, Zero Foxtrot. Uh, thanks for supporting the Zero Life. Uh, we believe that in the end, the most important part of Zero Foxtrot is you. We wouldn't be here without you, and we appreciate your continued support regardless of your background or what the future holds. We are honored to be the brand that helps you stay zero. And right there, it's backwards, I know, but whatever. Um, I've bought a couple of shirts from this company before, and uh, they are pretty, pretty good quality shirts. Um, I've had a couple of my shirts for about two years now. Um, I will go bring them real fast. I'll show you. Hold on. All right, so this shirt right here is the one that I get the most compliments about whenever I go out wearing it. Obviously, it's uh, some sort of a halo look um, with a skull in there, crossbones. The pattern is just, the color is just so vibrant. Um, I am 5'8", I'm about 200 pounds. Um, I'm not the most fit, but I'm also not obese, but... Um, they fit pretty good. They're comfortable. Um, I would suggest, you know, if you're in my size range, to either go with the large or the extra large. Um, I have an extra large, and I will try it on, and I'll show it to you real fast. But my other shirt is uh, the long sleeve of the uh, the Warrior. I have the Menace, which this one's like my favorite, but I don't wear it a whole lot. This one also is extra large, and I'll show you here in a minute. It's a little baggier. Um, this is my, uh, my deeds, um, and I, I had a pen open up in the washing machine and kind of messed it up, but you really can't notice. I wear that one a lot, and then I also got another, uh, I believe it's a warrior one, uh, the gray with the short sleeve. I really like that one too. Um, hold on, I'll show you the extra large. Alright, so this is the extra large. It's a little looser. Um, I like it, um, although when I go out it's a little longer on my pants as you can see uh, covers my nuts I don't know I like, I like my shirts a little bit higher up that's just me um, but it's a comfortable shirt the quality is it's just it's there um, I wash them in cold water I don't ever dry them I just hang dry them um, one of my shirts I do dry because at this point it's it's kind of it is what it is. I use it more of a uh, undershirt sometimes. Anyway, all right. So this one I believe is Bloodlust. So this is the uh, the new one that they just they just sent me a email about, and I was like, that looks badass. Um, fucking awesome. I um, have just changed my religion to Norse Pagan and uh, you know it's kind of like a Viking thing and all that but uh, you know I really thought this was a badass a badass quality design on the back you know it's just colorful vibrant it's gonna look good you know while I go out in the summertime and whatnot um, this is a large and this looks a lot bigger than my other larges so we'll see how it fits in a minute and let's look at the other one I forgot the name of this one I believe it was. Where is the opening? Oh, it. All right, this one is ah no rest for the wicked. This is a good one too. I I like this one, kind of that same vibe with it. 
um, kind of like a Viking theme. Um, pretty cool looking. I thought it looked really good, like a warrior. No rest for the wicked. You can see the design, the pattern on the back. These are on the back. These are my first ones of having the pattern on the back. So on the front, you get the skull with the, uh, the Z and the F in there, their, their logo. Really good quality. I can tell they look beautiful. I'm going to get a lot of compliments on that Bloodlust one for sure. This one as well. I usually get compliments wherever I go when I wear these shirts. So, um, hold on. <laughs> Video editing, I know. That's fine. It's here. All right, right off the bat, it's a large again. Um, it definitely feels a lot different than the, uh, the Halo design. Um, still kind of short. I like it. Um, it's tight where I want it to be, loose where I need it to be. I know it kind of shows my gut a little bit, but I've been working out, been doing keto, uh, just trying to stay fit, um, going through a divorce, just trying to do better with my life. So I wanted some new shirts, and uh, this fucking shirt looks badass. Excuse my French, but uh, yeah, I really, I really like this design on the back. It's just really nice. It feels great. Nice and tight on the sleeves. The quality's right there. Got the logo. It's it's all there. Um, nice shirt. Good quality. Um, I'm not going to try on the other one. It's obviously going to fit just like this one. Um, but I would like to say if Zero Fox Shot sees these videos or sees this video, whatever, I would love to have a business casual shirt like a collar just with the logo or maybe a design or something that I could wear to work and represent. Hopefully you guys design something like that. I'll definitely buy one or two or four. Who knows? Anyway, uh, my name is Vinny. Thanks for uh, tuning in.